The second thing we want to do when approaching someone confidently is we want to make good eye contact. And I know there's a lot of confusion. How do we make good eye contact without appearing too creepy and also not appearing aloof? So the simple rule of thumb we have here at The Art of Charm is we want to make eye contact when we're talking to someone and we want to turn and give them our ear when we are listening to someone. That breaking of eye contact creates a space for your mind to actually process mm -hmm. what it's hearing. And studies have shown that when we are making prolonged eye contact, our mind is not able to process communication effectively. So breaking that eye contact actually allows your mind to catch up and become more engaged in the conversation. Your eye contact is a direct window to your confidence in the interaction. It also allows the other person to know that you're speaking to them. And when we break eye contact, we want to break eye contact at eye level. We don't want our eyes darting up and we don't want our eyes darting down. It's actually going to distract the person that we're talking to. So we want to soften our eye contact when we're talking to them and break our eye contact, keeping them at eye level when we're listening. It's going to allow us to be more engaged and allow the other person to feel more comfortable with us.